It's Plymouth Art Weekend 2016 and I'm at 34 New Street, Plymouth Barbican with Tom, Glyn and Dave. Looking at the work of David Crocker, Glyn White, Tom Bird and a few others. This is old fashioned, that's what people did 200 years ago. Nothing's changed, it's like musical instruments. It's exactly the same, it's under open skies, it's a board or a canvas and it's paint with brushes. That's exactly what they did 200 years ago. You'll see in a minute, this on the right is modern. I can't move. 60 kids have now turned up and all they want to do is jump in the water. They've got no idea that I'm there. All right? And the camera is taking a picture every 12 seconds. So all of these are just chance photos. Including... That one. No, he isn't actually looking at the picture. He's, I think he's looking at something that's over there. But it looks as if he is. Okay. Now they know that I'm there. It's completely, it's completely modern on the right hand side. Okay, and they start playing up now and wanting to be in the film. So this is a series of things that just occurred from that accident of the too much space. Yeah. And this is the last one I'm going to show you, and it's a quick one. But again, it's an accident. So this is the morning code, and that bit of key is actually no longer there. When I did my Coast Puff pictures, I wouldn't put people in. But that bloke is there fishing I'm, for so long that I put him in. And there's a twist with him at the end of it. Okay, let me go towards the end and you can... But that's really old. been old. Okay. Right, here comes the twist of the fish. Okay, so that is the fisherman. He he bought it. His daughter was down there swimming, and she said, "Here, yeah, Dad, there's a bloke doing a painting, and you're in it." So we come round and said, "I said 110 with the frame." So what he's got at home is that original oil painting, and he's in it. But he's also got that film, and he's in it. But even better, it's in a frame like that, the original. He's got that photo in an identical frame just next to it. And that's where the idea of doing weddings came from. So I do weddings, turn up, paint a church, do it like that. And then at the reception, the film is played back in the evening at the reception. Okay, thanks for letting me turn it back. No, thank you. Okay, and that was yesterday. So that was yesterday's I have these in situ. Uh, so have this picture with that film yeah. up in that location where I paint you. Yeah. I possibly with the picture facing one way, the paint the other, or no, probably one on top of the other. Okay. So to have this out somehow with that picture underneath yeah. and the film playing above it at locations around the route of the art thing. So I could spend a year picking up probably 20 images, but then I would need a mechanism of displaying that. So what's this uh, picture, Glenn? This is just being finished and about to be signed. Um, yeah. It's called um, Bantham, because it's from Bantham. Yeah. Uh, summer, hang on, Summer Solstice Sunrise. Uh -huh. um, because it sort of, the summer solstice, yeah, I was there for the sunrise. So when, did you, so when did you start it? I started it a couple of days afterwards. Yeah. Um, I did put a post on on my <clears throat> art page um, saying that it was nearly finished and I just needed a couple of tweaks. Um, and then I've done a bit more than just tweaking it. <laughs> but it's an, one of a number that are very close to being finished. Well, this one is about to be signed. What's this other one called? Um, Hello, Deacon first. How are you? Deacon's a bit tired. Yeah, a long day yesterday. We're actually at Bantham and then um, Kingsbridge, seeing a friend's exhibition and uh, photography, and then um, 
out to Slapton, so it was a good day, a long day, so he's and, happily tired. And you had the, the art weekend as well, which is very yeah. taken in sense. There were lots of people coming in the door. Yeah, that was, I mean, it was really good. Cause that but really... Tom Bird was missing, don't know where he was. Well, yeah. That artist. <laughs> <laughs> but he's, I, I, well, he's uh, as, of, as of Saturday, yeah. actually going to be part of the studio. Cool. So, so this is in New Street. What's the number in New Street? Number thirty four. Number thirty New Street, the barn. Thirty four. Thirty four New Street, the barbican. Yeah, and we're up. We're up the top, and the buzzer says, "Barbican New Street Artists." And what's downstairs in? Uh, in You've got Chris. Um, Chris Robinson. Chris Robinson's um, shop down on the fir uh, ground floor. And you enter. Your, your entrance is on the right hand side of his shop. Yes, and then um, pin and pose directly below us yeah and then we're up the top here so what's this painting called I love the uh, lighting in it um I've forgotten the well I was going to call it after the storm but I realized looking at it that the storm is actually approaching because most storms come from the west you can call it before the storm then so it, or storm approaches so it's going to be something along those lines yeah, yeah. that one's of Wembury uh -huh. I've still got some work to do on that one um, and then that one is Memories of the Mimram, which I started ages ago, but I'm now determined to get finished. And that's part of my childhood. That's where I used to go tadpoling as a little boy. I was thinking about that. Uh, at the weekend, you don't see a lot of frogs and newts and... and, um, and... I've got loads in my back garden. Have you really? Yeah. I used to go collecting great crested newts and newts and put them in tanks at home when they all died. So I didn't ah, do that's much, why they were, uh, no. didn't do much for preservation. Yeah. No, I've got loads of palmate newts, uh -huh. uh, which are not common throughout the UK, but are very common in the southwest. Uh -huh. I have loads, hundreds and hundreds in my pond at the moment. Thank you. Um, so what about uh, toads? Yeah, there's toads around the garden, frogs. Uh -huh. That's good. Well, toads. look after them. Yeah. yeah. I've not seen them in years. And slow worms. Uh -huh. And I have had How do you one. know the slow worms? Oh, don't you do it. No, no, no bad puns. No bad puns. I, know, I haven't put them on, actually. I was waiting for you to come up with one. Um, um, and, and I have had the odd grass snake in there as well, which is great. Did you have an adder? No, but I have seen... I've seen... I've, I've, I've finally got to see an adder a few weeks ago. Um, it's on a footpath coming up to Wembley Point. Nice big, big female. Um, yeah. Yeah. But there's loads, I mean, there's loads yeah. of banks them. They've got signs up saying beware of adders. Yeah. And you do see a lot around Wembury yeah. as well. Beautiful animals. So a gather on the hose all gone in here. Yeah, yeah. yeah very sad. Uh, as I said before, you know, it's not gone because of uh, failure. It went because of uh, redevelopment of the cafe above. Yeah. Um, but I'm, I'm very fortunate to be sharing this studio. Yeah, with um, friends. With, with friends and with Tom. And <laughs> Tom the clubber. Oh, well, one weekend. The London clubber. London clubber. <laughs> Well, I don't, I don't know, we won't go on that. There's a ticket I booked last winter and it coincided with the Art Weekender, so uh -huh. uh, ended up. So, what are you doing, Tom? Pounds down in the. It, but it was a good night. I've just started one actually. And what's this one called? Uh, I'm not sure yet. This is. Oh, a, that's an unusual name for painting. Yeah, and I'm not sure yet. Uh, it's like um, a photo I took in Cornwall. Yes. Walked with my friend from Crantock near Newquay to Perrinport. Uh huh. And on the way, just saw these seal pups. That's where they were sort of like um, breeding around the area. Uh -huh. So yeah, that's it's probably going to be a triptych, three seal, like the same seal. You sort of body surf in that wave there. And then he's like, oh, where am I? And then he pops his head up there. So, <laughs> might be quite, you, you sent know. a letter to us, uh, uh, to an animal at sea like that? I sent a letter to a seal? You'd always have to open it because the letter's always sealed. The yeah, letter's work. always sealed. It didn't work at all, but, hey. no, but never mind. <laughs> <laughs> just got, got to look, get, got to get, just go along with my humour sometimes, Tom. Hey, okay. this is it, this is it. <laughs> so, well done anyway. It's nice to have you in 32 New Street, the Barbican. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so, Excuse me, good vibe. There's a great community around here, actually. Look through the windows and what can you see? Oh, you've got another gallery over there. Oh. Gallery. Yeah. And Sue Wills. Got, Sue Wills, yeah. And then you've got the Lankovich Gallery further up. Just up there. In White Lane. Yeah, 
Then you got then you got a tattoo studio there, which is also I see is quite you know very creative. And so this thing. is the most historical part of Plymouth now, isn't it? Really? Yes. Yeah, so all the swastbuckling stuff on top. There's Laura's place, um, the oh, pretty Tillam. little things opposite too as well. So it's a lovely little hub of. And below us we got a photographer as well. Yeah. Yeah. And she's yeah, a very nice. good photographer Tillam as well. Yeah. Portrait and family photographer, and she does weddings as well. Yeah. Yeah. What's, yeah. She, what's her name? Um. Caroline oh. Shapiro, her company's pin and pose. Yeah, cool. Thank you very much. Yeah, um, great. So all going really? on. <laughs> Magic. And Dave's still here. Dave's still here, yes, <laughs> although he's out and about at the moment. I think he's up in Cambridge. So, what are you doing now, Glenn? I'm yes. about to sign the painting. Yeah, oh it's finished. That's interesting, you do it upside down. Yes, yes. Two reasons. This is your trademark. It, well, it's sort of become, yeah, but there are two reasons behind that. Uh, one... Don't have a sneeze when you're doing it. No, I'm left-handed. Uh -huh. So it's actually easier to sign up there than down there. How easy is, is it for you to use a <coughs> computer then? Sorry? How is it easy is it for you to use a computer then? Uh, that, well, I just have the mouse on the other side. Yeah. But... Does it squeak a lot? Really? Sorry, really stupid joke. <laughs> really stupid joke, and I'm concentrating on getting the right okay. colour for the signature. Um, right. Now, the, the other reason I sign paintings upside down is that... You think I've, you're in Australia? <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go on. Um, I've lost it now. No, um, is I always like to look at the composition of a painting upside yeah. down uh -huh. to see that it actually works as a piece. It does actually. That the the composition balances. Yeah. And it's much easier to to look at a piece upside down subjectively and see the shapes and the forms and the colour uh -huh. rather than the subject yeah. and just make sure that it does actually work uh, and, and that's the point that I sign it. So. Sorry to get in your way. Right. Blinding you with the camera. I'm intimidating you. No. We've got And it's 2016, isn't it? From 2016 has nearly gone already. It's ridiculous, isn't it? It's gone so fast. But oh, an awful God. lot's happened in the last 18 months since I... Oh, Christ. Nearly two years since I've known you both. Yeah, right? I know. It's absolutely... Would you think we... That was starting in the... Oops. In the pop-ups down at Sutton Harbour. And look where we've progressed to. Yeah. Sharing our own studio. Yeah, artists have come and gone. Yeah, yeah and right. I know. But, ooh, whoops. Sharing our own studio actually on the Barbican. I, I, I was really quite Great amazed. Great place to be. Yeah. yeah. I never believed that was going to happen. <laughs> um, so now we just go with a lighter colour to define that. It's an art form in itself. Yeah. Well, what we've got here, you've got a W. And then a G, a Glyn, W for white, and, and then the number on the D is my middle name. There we go. Thank you very much. That is now signed. I just need to... It's looking good. And how much will you sell this one for? I, I, I don't know yet. I, I haven't even thought about it. No. What do you say it's called? Um, Bantham Summer Solstice Sunrise. Yeah, thank you. No, thank you, Chris. <laughs> i
on now The time has took its place You call me every night now And I'm not gonna chase Cause all I ever wanted Was you, you Thanks to Glenn White, Davey, Davey Crocker, and Tom Brody Man. You can find them all on Facebook and at Saatchi. Thanks also to Plymouth Arts Weekend 2016. Music on this video with great thanks by Chris Oxland, Oxy Music. You can Facebook him in Plymouth. Available for gigs. This has been a Chris on my field media production or vlog. You can contact me at ccsphoto12 at hotmail.com. If you'd like to sponsor me, it's a lifestyle thing. Be who you want to be. I want to be free.